Hey guys, how's it going? It's Drew here, and I am back with another edition of Better Homes and Mines. And today, we're going to be doing a tiny house. Now, I tried to record this one before, and for some reason, things just didn't go right. And I may or may not have lost the video. Shame on me. So, perfect. We're going to be building this, but since I like the spruce wood, I made a taiga biome. So we're going to build it in that, and hopefully you guys enjoy. So let's get right to the tutorial. So the first thing you'll want to do is you'll want to find an open area. If you cannot find an open area, make one yourself. That should do nicely, right? Maybe a little more. There we go. That area looks like it's gonna get nice and cleared out for our tiny house now. And now that that's all cleared out, let's... Fill this in, and because I like having a little bit more area to work with because of the deck, I'm going to do that. And then we can always grow more trees around it. But anyway, let's get to the initial building. Now that I've got the materials, let's get started. So, the first thing you'll want to do is place logs in a fashion like that. Then you'll have one, two, three, four five, six, seven. And on the seventh one, place the block, and then you'll have it just like that. Build up one on each of these, and then brace them, like so. All these sheep are so annoying. Might have to get rid of them. Anyway, there you go. There is your foundation. Fill it in with your spruce wood. And boom, there's your floor. Then you'll want to bring these up more. I'm just going to do two for now. Then you'll want to fill in all the walls here. to that point. That's where the uh, door is going to be, is where that I left that gap. Then there's going to be a wall here separating this into a little room as well. Then you can build all the walls up one more block. And then if you want you can do this. Oops, that. I kind of like that, but for a tiny house, maybe not. I don't know, because it's going to be like that anyway. I don't know. Tiny houses are supposed to be small, so I'm going to keep it small. Anyway, there's your roof. And there you go. There's your tiny house. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, leave a like and a comment. If you didn't enjoy it, dislike. Tell me why you didn't. Like it, and, oh, I forgot one little detail, but one more spruce wood, like that. Anyway, there you go, there's your tiny house, hope you guys enjoyed. Like, subscribe, and comment, if you did enjoy it, dislike, and comment why you didn't like if you didn't like it. Alright, see you guys later, bye! I'm just kidding, there's a lot more to it. As you probably noticed in the little start uh, bit. So, why don't we do the deck? So the deck's always fun. So you want to start the deck by doing that. Then you'll have your supports for the deck. 
there and there. And then you'll have your fence going around it. Okay, maybe I should bring it out one more. Maybe I did that. Not much for a tiny house. That's a very tiny deck. <laughs> it's quite a large deck, actually. It might be a bigger deck than the house, I don't know. <laughs> anyway, there you go. There's that. And you can fill that in like that. Then, because you can't for some reason place just a gate over that, you gotta do that. And that. And then you can have that. I kinda like that. And there you have that. So then the next part of your house is gonna be up here. This is where the ladder is gonna go. So, we'll build a perimeter around this. Most tiny houses, if you ever watch the show, have more or less just a loft that you have to crawl into. For Minecraft, that's a problem because you won't wake up in a very good position. So, to counteract that, the roofing that we do is going to allow two high ceilings. Like so. Because we'll have just like that. It'll work perfectly. See? So, you can fill that in. Just going up to a point like that. Oops. And there we go. There is your tiny house upstairs done. Put some window pans right there. What? You don't connect to stairs? That's the weirdest thing I've ever seen. Okay. So maybe you have to keep your uh, logs right there, like that, in order for the window panes to work perfectly. But there you go, there is your tiny house. Now, let's kinda open it up, make it a little bit, wow, that was almost placed right, a little bit brighter in here, there's your windows, there's that. Alright, I think that'll do it. Yeah. A small little house doesn't take a lot for resources, just just some wood. Now, let's get to making the interior a little bit prettier. And before I do, I'll make a little bench so you can just stare at all the ugly freaking sheep that keep it fire at me. Alright, let's get to interior materials. Alright, it's becoming night again. Just like in my last uh, tutorial, which is perfect. So you can kind of figure where you want your torches at for your deck, your outside area. Might be wise to put some up on the roof, like so. Kind of keep the uh, monsters from spawning up there. In here, you'll have a crafting table. You'll have your furnace. You will have a table there with a flower pot and a little flower you'll have your ladder going up here you'll have a chest here we'll have another trap chest there if you can make them then you'll have your beds here that I'll get in a little bit but oh yeah you can something that I do instead of torches since it's such a small space is I'll take like a sea lantern if you have um, access to one and just put it there or you can use gl <coughs> excuse me glowstone 
It'll work just as good. That's cool. Alright, so... Then we go into here. It's gray. It's too gray. Because, as always, you need a bathroom. Three, four, five, six. If you want six, you can do six. Kinda looks a little bit too derpy for me, so I like seven. And then you gotta get your bed. And you can put your two beds right there. And that finishes up the interior of your tiny house. You got plenty of storage. And if you wanted, you could put another set above that. Just like so. So you have two... Oops. Oh my gosh, I keep doing things wrong. Anyway, yeah. There is your... Uh, Tiny house, interior, exterior, and all the terriers. Not to be confused with terriers. This is a dog. This looks ugly. This looks ugly. And then if you want, you can always spruce it up. <laughs> Get spruce, because this spruce saplings. It's a spruce house. Spruce it up. <laughs> Well, I appreciate my jokes. At least one person does. I hope someone does out there. Uh oh. That wasn't good. You can do that. Oops. Shouldn't have put it over my bone meal. You got all sorts of different trees you can get with these spruce trees. It just kind of disguises your house. Like, kind of keeps it out of sight. It's good for factions. I've actually done that, and I haven't actually gotten raided or anything like that. And I'm not even in a faction, so... It's working great. So, that'll do it. Hope you guys enjoyed this tiny house tutorial. Oh, I forgot something. If you don't like that, you can do this. I guess with the glowstone, you don't really need torches on the inside. You're... Glass will just look a little derpy. And I mean, with these second chests, you won't even be able to see, so you can't always do this. With these, it, it will be a little derpy, but... Oh, I don't know. Things to be symmetrical, and I don't, I don't know. I'll have to figure that out. If I do, I'll let you guys know. But anyway, thank you guys for watching. If you liked the video, please do leave a like and a comment. Let me know what you'd like to see next. If you did not like it, dislike it. Tell me what you didn't like, what I could do differently. Feedback is always appreciated. I mean, being a small starting YouTuber, anything is helpful. Constructive or deconstructive criticism, I do not care. Anyway, uh, also, favorite if you would like... Uh, I mean, some tutorials are pretty insane, and this is not one of them, but who knows. And subscribe, too, if you'd like to see more of these con the content that I put out. I mean, I'm not only Minecraft, I'm Team Fortress 2, I'm all sorts of stuff. And, I'll, of course, I'll be doing more tutorials as well. So, again, do whatever you'd like. Like, subscribe, comment, whatever. And I guess I'll see you guys in the next video. Hope you enjoyed. Bye, guys. I think this will shut him up once and for all. This is what happens when you annoy me with your buying. Pricks. Peace and quiet.